Dark matter. I've been looking for it since 1884, when Lord Kelvin first opened this case by estimating the number of dark bodies in the Milky Way. Through his measurements, he concluded that many of our stars, perhaps a great majority of them, may be dark bodies. What makes this case one of the biggest mysteries for the modern investigators, I mean scientists, is that dark matter constitutes 85% of the gravity of the universe, and we don't know what it is, and the little do we know of what it is composed of. I mean, it's not composed of regular matter, the one constituted in planets, us, stars. What makes it even more frustrating is that it is the majority of our universe. Let me break it down for you. You have all this chocolate, and you are allowed to eat only 4% of it. This is the percentage of ordinary matter in our universe. 74% is dark energy and 22% is dark matter. I always say that there is nothing such as a perfect criminal. And dark matter is definitely not one. We've been gathering evidence around its crime scenes, even if it doesn't interact with light. In 1933, Fritz Zwicky was studying a cluster of galaxies called the Coma Cluster. We know that when galaxies orbit around each other, the faster they go, the more gravitational attraction they need to hold on to each other. And more gravity means more mass. What Zwicky did is that he used the brightness of the galaxies to calculate their mass, and then orbital speed to calculate it again. Surprisingly, he found that there was missing mass, which is, which means, that there was something out there he couldn't see, which is dark matter. The next evidence comes straight from the stars, literally. When you look at a star, light comes straight at you. But if you put a massive object between you, like a galaxy, light bends. This is called gravitational lensing. When we use this phenomenon, we find that there is missing mass between objects in the cosmos. Not only that, but stars around galaxies also move faster than they should be, which is evidence of missing mass too, and dark matter. The question that needs an answer is, what is dark matter? There are many speculations that dark matter may be just regular matter from other universes that are applying their gravity on us. And I won't rest until this mystery is solved.